We're going to start with a proto-oncogene called RAS, which is implicated in about a third of all cancers in human beings. In its normal form, the RAS gene codes for molecules that encourage the cell to progress through the cell cycle. Here's RAS as a proto-oncogene. RAS is a G protein. You can see that it's positioned on the inside of the membrane close to a receptor. When a ligand binds with that receptor, RAS becomes activated and it initiates a phosphorylation cascade. At the end of the cascade, a transcription factor is activated that codes for a growth factor. That growth factor encourages the cell to move through the cell cycle. When the RAS proto-oncogene mutates, it becomes an oncogene. The oncogene version of RAS is constitutively activated. That means that it's activated all of the time. Even without a signal from outside of the cell, RAS activates the phosphorylation cascade and transcribes genes that produce a growth factor. The result is that the cell enters into the cell cycle when it shouldn't. This kind of inappropriate cell division can lead to cancer.